Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Senua's Sacrifice. As you can see, I managed to get it into uh, to get it, uh, the titles to turn to English. Uh, I just had to switch the language of the uh, PS4. So let's move forward in our grand adventure. Yeah, this is where we stopped. This looks breakable, maybe? Oh! Oh! oh. There are more now. Fuck! Leave me be. Oh, that's not good. And I'm already like half dead. Okay, slow. Slow, slow, slow. Let's take it slow. No! I really appreciate the voice like telling me. Uh, okay, now I'm really scared because I can tell that I'm barely alive. Oh yes! Woo! Fuck. That was really freaking close. Oh snap. The audio... Uh, of the fight is like really spot on the sounds of uh, clashing irons and stuff oh I can see another guiding uh, stone or whatever I'm really bummed I couldn't get to the other one the Northmen say that Odin and his brothers killed Ymir and that the world of man was formed from his corpse they made his bones into stone and his flesh into earth and his blood into the salt sea they set his the Northmen say that Odin oh, and his sorry. brothers killed <laughs> Ymir, and that the world of man was formed from his corpse. They made his bones into stone, and his flesh into earth, and his blood into the salt sea. They set his skull to be the bowl of the sky, with his brains for clouds. Odin and his brothers caught the sparks flying from Muspel, and made them into stars. And to protect the new world from the giants, they used Ymir's great curving eyebrows as walls. Okay. Anything hidden here? Or just the... Oh yeah, now the... Now that we climbed, uh, the illusion of the fence disappears. Huh. Okay. Anything? Some walls there. Oh, it's still like warm. Okay. Oh. That hand does not look promising. Okay. 
Probably Do another. You know what it's like to leave everything behind. Your home, loved ones. To head deep into the wilds, perhaps never to return. Senua does, because when darkness speaks, it changes everything. Turning home into a foreign land and loved ones into strangers. Exile makes sense when you realize that you were never really home in the first place. Poor Senua. Okay, what do we have here? The Northmen say you must sacrifice in order to receive. They tell how the runes were revealed to Odin only in sacrifice. He hung himself from the world tree, and he stabbed himself with a spear, and he dedicated the sacrifice to himself. For nine nights he hung on the tree without food or drink, and at last he saw the runes below him. He gave a cry and gathered them in his mind and learnt them. Then he fell from the tree. Oh, we're probably gonna have to yeah, align a lot of those, maybe. Like plenty of those effigies. Raven symbols or whatever. I see a portal. Oh, it's becoming a bit blurry. How do I get up from here? Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. We have several pathways. Where are the doors? Just let me quickly check if there are any other lower stones around. Oh, this guy is po pointing. Ah, okay. Sure. I really like the idea for the um, for those illusions that you just have to cross to the gateways, kinda, to be able to see. I know it's like pretty simple, but for me it's really effective, narratively. Uh, but yeah, for now let's trigger the door so we can start our search. a long time ago. Why did she go to the world? She wanted to fight her own darkness. <laughs> she thought she could beat her own darkness. Did she beat her darkness? No. <laughs> it nearly killed her, but she tried. 
Druth. Druth helped her. If it wasn't for Druth, she'd, she'd be, be dead. dead. She can't beat her own darkness. She wanted to marry Dillian. She came to beat her own darkness and marry Dillian. But she didn't thought, work. She thought her curse would affect him. She thought her curse would spread to him. She thought she'd bring the darkness to him too. She nearly died. She thought the curse made her tainted. Druth helped her. Well, that's really sad. Okay, I think I chose wrong because I don't hear the song. Well, it seems that few of them disappear. The ravens. They're gone. They're gone. No. Oh. Half of them have gone. They're gone. Some are still there. But where? Some are still there. No. Oh, Raven's helping. Okay. He's not helping. It's true. Quiet. Quiet. I can't Out in the wild. In the cold winter woods. Where have they gone? She no longer felt fit for this world. She almost gave in to the darkness. She remembered Dillian's words. She remembered her promise. She resolved to fight on and kill that which had become a part of her. This one's pointing there. Anything changes? Oh yeah, now there's a platform. Let's lower this one too. See if we can get this door to open. Maybe. Open it. Open it. Yeah. <laughs> Not from this You asshole. Uh, okay, I can get down. In here? This portal. Oh, yes. Okay. Oh, so we have several pathways, it seems. We have one here. Oh, and there's a stone, okay. The lower stone. Messages from Druf. The Northmen say that Odin is always in search of knowledge and wisdom and magic. There was a very wise being named Mimir, who guarded the waters of wisdom which flow from the roots of the world tree. Odin wished to drink from this spring, but he had to pay a price. So he gouged out his own eye as offering to Mimir. He drank from the well and traded one way of seeing for another. Okay. Are we gonna fight Odin by the end?
Let's go up. Oh. Um. Oops. Wait, there was a way where the, the, they were connected, right? Oh, 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 okay. Let's open the door. I think I get it. Because the portal that opened up uh, the wall for us, I think also took away the passage. And now that we opened the door, we don't need it anymore. The hole, that is. Am I right? I think I'm right. Am I a smart boy? Freaking fires. Okay. I'm a smart boy. So we have another portal. Yeah, that takes away. Okay. Where have they gone? She did it, but what does it mean? Looking back. I was so naive to think she could banish it on her own. The further she saw into the darkness, the more she struggled to see anything at all. And the glow. The smallest hints of shape, sound, or thought grew in strength until they consumed her whole. Before she knew it, the darkness had her in its claws. No such thing as victory when it comes to the darkness. It's like it doesn't want to kill her. Yet. Or gnaw at her. Biding its time. Only when she is at her weakest will it strike to kill. Will she find Dillian before her time comes? So, bastard, are you here? Or another set of those phantom Northmen? Or yet another door to open. Okay. And a lower stone is nearby. Oh. Okay. Oh, oh, this seems foreboding. Isn't it? Both seen the darkness, so was their 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 uh, sick too. Okay, I can make it here. Yeah, I wonder why he was on the exile. Them. Okay, so I can move up here. I can go there. Here. Okay. 
Ah, uh, you do we have the pathway now? We'll see. Speak to me, Drew. Tell me a story. Senua, listen. I will tell you the tale of a man called Findon. The Northman captured Findon's sister, and his father sent him to pay for her release. But they took his gold, put him in chains, and held him for a day and a night without food or water. Then they released him. I don't know why. Upon his return, his father's enemies in Erin set fire to his home. His father burnt to death, and his brother was killed. But he escaped with sorrow in his heart. His father's enemies offered redress for his loss and invited him to a feast that was at a hall near the sea. But when he went there, they betrayed him to the Northmen, who enslaved him and took him to hell. Six years later, his slave masters landed on the shores of Orkney, burning all before them. And into that fire, Findon made his escape. What was Findon? burnt away that day but from the flames a new man stepped forward and Drew oh. was born Drew the man that I am now oh and though Findon never set eyes on his dear sister again I Drew I've found you, Senua. I wish you could have seen my home before these dark times. Well, I'm glad I got my answer. Okay, uh, through the portal again. Wow, everyone in this game is just so freaking sad. <laughs> I really feel for them. Please don't fall. didn't end well in the wilds. It never does. You think you can overcome the darkness, make sense of it, and once relief settles in, strikes out of nowhere, throwing you helplessly back into the maelstrom, drowning the mind in fear, deeper, deeper. Driving you it's down happening. so far into the void that maybe this time there is no coming back. Help me. But there, Help. in the darkness, Senua. And she remembered what he told her. Hear me. Reach out to me. Help. Senua. Take my iron mirror. Look into it. For it is a window into the underworld. Within. You will see the face of the darkness that you fear. And if you focus, like I have taught you to, you will also see that as much as the darkness has you trapped within its veil, 
It too is trapped within yours. Focus. 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 I see. I see you now. You led me to the wilds. You trapped me there. Gotcha. Oh wow, he's fast. Oh wow. Oh wow wow. Today. Oh, 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 not good. Oh, nice. Awesome, awesome move, you bastard. Sure, send your freaking lucky to do your bidding. Oh, of course, send two now, two at a time, cool. No, 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 no! Ah, <sighs> uh, freaking assholes. Hate you so much. I will get your blood. Oh, move, move, move. Ah, gotcha, you bastard. Whoa, 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 ah, uh -huh. gotcha now, gotcha now. Ah, the scream. We are so close. Uh, move, move, move. No, you asshole. No, damn it. Can you have? 
Oh! I can slaughter your god boss, you have any chance? Oh, of course you have, because now there are three of you. So, yeah, kinda, kinda fair. Yeah, I know, I know I'm trying, but thanks for the help, boys. Ugh, sometimes I forgot the block button like a board. Okay. Sure, I'm coming. Cocky bastard. Oh, but he seems like half there. Okay, okay. I'm trying. Oh, okay. So now I have to make you visible. Mine. You will die. Do you think you can stop me? Did I do it? Never beat you in the wilds, did I? It was an illusion. But not this time! Oh wow. The mark of Valraven. One of the keys to the gate to Helheim. Hold it in your mind's eye. With every battle, the darkness grows stronger. Every victory bringing her closer to defeat. Unfair, isn't it? In those dark winter nights in the wilds, there were times when she considered letting go. If it weren't for truth, a chance encounter in the wilds. She would not have heard his stories of the Northmen. And she would not have this chance to find Dillian's soul. I'm coming. Oh wow guys, uh, yeah, I think this is a good time to stop for today, that fight was so awesome, uh, so cinematic, I mean the, how it looked, how it sounded, uh, yeah, I, I, I loved it, I loved the theme of Valraven, oh wow, yeah, I, <laughs> I'm really into this game as you probably can tell. 
Uh, so I really hope that you like it too, and I hope to see you in the next episode. Uh, thanks guys, and bye bye.